Make the most exotic sandwich. You have ten minutes to plan your exotic sandwich. Then ten minutes to construct it. Your time starts now. Right. What do you think exotic means? That, to me, says maybe fillings that have never been seen in a sandwich before. Um. OK. So, what I would like, please, is some Moroccan flatbread. Turkish delight. That's very exotic. Get me some wholemeal bread and maybe some pita bread as well. Wholemeal, though. I'm not an idiot. So, I need a kumquat. Greg's sausage roll. Kiwi fruit. It's going all sweet. Mm. Heck, everyone's going to go savoury, aren't they? Some smoked trout. Then a crunchy bar. Then a Kit Kat. Then a double decker. Oh, a yam. Tequila. Some tequila. What they eat in France? Uh, croissants. Okay, I'll go shopping. Okay. Shall I come with you? No, thank you. Do you need money? No. Okay. Bag for life. See you later. <laughs> I want to start with Mel. She mm -hmm. looked very excited, and I'm keen to see her sandwich. OK, she did say before she started, I want to blow the Taskmaster's tiny mind. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> this is so good. Right. Chocolate spread. Good layer of the chocolate orange. Little bread ski. Double deckers. A bit more of a Nutella. Let's go for the crunchy. Three minutes. Three minutes? What? Let's do some m &Ms. Oh. Maltese. I can see why people get stressed out on these cookery shows. This is absolutely appallingly stressful. Just bronzing up the marshmallows. That, to me, is like a, a sort of Japanese pagoda. Can I give you this as well, Mel? Just, yes. Um, to say thank you. Is that for me? Yes. Thank you. Eat your exotic sandwich, fastest wins. Final line, please, Mel. What's the task say, Mel? Time starts now. OK. Oh, gang. Showbiz nights, eh? <laughs> Slot in M&M's. Only blue ones. Only blue ones. <laughs> is it exotic, that sandwich? It's sort of... I mean, it's instant diabetes, isn't it? <laughs> well, I suppose so. It was uh, Turkish Delight, Crunchy Kit Kat, Double Decker Twix, Snickers M&M's, Icing Sugar, Marshmallows, Chocolate Eggs, Chocolate Oranges, Nutella and a Blowtorch. I suppose it's sort of... <laughs> it's sort of exotic. <laughs> so you're going to judge the most exotic and I'll tell you... It's meant to be who can eat their sandwich the fastest. I can reveal nobody finished their sandwich. <laughs> so it's, it's who ate the most of their sandwich. You ate four good-sized bites, uh, essentially one double-decker, and you inhaled the M&M. <laughs> it's got to be a bonus, a nasal M&M, isn't it? Always. <laughs> Write down as many obscure animals as possible. You have three minutes. Your time starts now. Um, Duckbill platypus. That's quite obscure. The lesser-spotted blue tit. Saber-toothed tiger. Oh, yeah. Very obscure now. Dodo, obscure. T Rex, obscure. Dead. Piranha, hear a lot about them, very rarely see them. Liger. A liger? Yeah. Lovely. It's pretty obscure. Would you mind taking that list into the living room now, please? Yes. 
the T-Rex. an obscure animal? It is where I live. OK, <laughs> <laughs> okay we're now going to see Asim making his list before he knew he was going to have to act them out. Here yeah. I mean, strap yourself. <laughs> Blue dog. Three-eyed raven. Three-eyed raven. Anorexic elephant. Anorexic elephant. A bollock cat. A bollock cat. Uh, dodo. Laser beam turtle. Got your proper task now. Oh, fuck. Guess the animals that your teammate has on their list. Your teammate must only use mine. Your time starts now. Dog. Dog. Pen dog. Hound dog. Top Lid bed, top dog. dog. Lid. Blue, blue dog. Blue dog. Blue dog. What? That famous breed. The blue dog. Two oh, yeah. words. Second word? Elephant. Elephant. First word? <laughs> Thin. Guppy elephant. Thin elephant. Somebody's got a disease for eating. Anorexic. Anorexic elephant. Three words. First word. Eight. Eight. Second word. Balls. <laughs> Eight balls. Bollocks. Eight bollocked. Whiskers. Moustache. Cat. Head. Eight bollocked cat. Right. One word. Two syllables. Pockets. Deal. 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 Cash. Dough. 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 Okay. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. How's dough? Two okay. syllables. Don't know. Dodo. 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 Three words. words. First, First word. word. Shoot. Bullet. Um, laser. Careful. Laser. Laser. Third word. Shy badger. You've got a really big head. Hooded. Laser. Are hooded. you an anteater? Turtle. Laser. Laser, laser rain. Right. A. B. B. Beam. Laser beam. Laser, laser beam. beam. Tortoise. Perfect. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you very Thank much. You. I mean, honestly, really... frankly, miraculous. Yeah. Uh, you guess any. But the world of real obscure animals, not obscure enough for you. <laughs> I'm really frightened of anorexic elephants. <laughs> <laughs> I flipped it, mate. I flipped it. And honestly, I would have. I, I'm sure I speak for everybody. I would have bet my life that you wouldn't have been able to convey eight bollocks. <laughs> <cat>. oh. <laughs> It was Tim who got that, and you said the word bollock, and you um, were so surprised that you swore. Yeah, yeah. You got it right. You had to. It's not your it fault. Was... It's the name of the creature. <laughs> <laughs> 13 on their list, 11 to beat. They scored eight. Oh. 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 When you hear this siren... ..during a future task... ..put on a boiler suit and lie flat on the ground. Boiler suit on now. That's how I'll remember it. OK. <laughs> you may not touch or move a boiler suit until the siren sounds. Fastest wins. Do you understand the task? Yeah, I'm not a fucking idiot. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to wait there, are you? Until the siren sounds. OK, it might not happen today. <laughs> I think it will. Now we play the waiting game. Bye, Rod. See you later. <laughs> How long did we stand there for? Genuinely 20 minutes. Incredible. <laughs> Camera's cut. We all... Yeah, we just left you there. We were quite worried. Because <laughs> I guess we assumed that... You would assume that it wasn't going to be in the immediately next task. Yeah. Just like everyone else except you. <laughs> um, <laughs> more of that later, then. Tie yourself up as securely as possible. <laughs> Where'd you get off on this stuff? I'm just doing what I'm told. Is it sexual? Slowest to be released by Alex wins. You have ten minutes. Your time starts now. Right. Rope. Good. Is it sexual? No, it's just a task based on how you make me go to sleep every night. You say, tie yourself up. <laughs> Go to sleep, and then you untie me in the Rack on with sleep. Yeah. Good. <laughs> Finally, here is Rod's interpretation of the task. Ha, ha, ha. OK. 
Alex, would you uh, would you sit there, please? <laughs> Seven minutes to go, Rod. Yeah, but that's okay. It's quite tight. It's quite tight. Yeah. It's fine as long as you can breathe. That should be fine. Have we done this before? Yeah. How's that? Quite tight. Yeah, that's tight. So we're some tight. What's that noise? Uh, that's the siren. Is it just a local noise? No. What siren? What siren is that? You had to do something when the siren sounded. Yes, two tasks on the go now, yeah. isn't there? This is the problem, isn't it? lie on the ground, wasn't it? OK, I've stopped the clock for that class now. You've completed that one. The boiler suit? That's done. OK. Now, I'm going to untie you in 1 minute 55 seconds. OK. Put the hand in there. And the shoe? Yeah. <laughs> 40 seconds. Four. Oh, I don't know how long is that. I'm going to count. There's 30, 35 yeah, so seconds. There's 31, Thank 30. You. Hang on a minute, then. I'm blowing my whistle. OK, yeah, blow your whistle now. OK, I'm coming to untie you. Yeah, I'm tied up. I'm going to go and get a hot drink. I'll... I'm coming. You're coming for me, are you? Yep. <laughs> I'm going to untie you any second now. Do you want something for lunch? This, please. What would you like? Something sharp. <laughs> OK. I'll get you. I suppose you're going to have a go at me and shout and scream and no, uh, accuse genius. me of cheating. That was fucking kick ass. Lord, that is <laughs> absolutely <laughs> genius. Yeah. 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 Oh, we'd love to hate that. Yeah. We'd love to hate that, but that was fucking brilliant, great. Brilliant. Yeah. <laughs> I think your teammates are right to praise you because it was uh, mightily impressive. But the thing that I noticed, above and beyond the, how clever your response was, is how cold you were. <laughs> Just a psychopath. There was no need to put a bucket on his head, was there? That was <laughs> well beyond no. the brief. Or, or a hat on the bucket. Yeah. <laughs> I never actually untied him. He untied himself in the end and then came and untied me. <laughs> <laughs> Got to be a bonus point. <laughs> no. 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 Oh, come on! <laughs> No, no, no. So, Nish, there are three items on that table and three tasks. I can see them. Three tasks, three items. You can open them in any order you want. OK. You will be opening all three in the course of the task. Well, then I'm not going to overthink that part. Look interesting. Go central. We always go for the left. We always go for the left. Right to left, Arabic style. Mm, <laughs> Yes, if you don't mind me saying, you're an <laughs> absolute dreamboat. In it? <laughs> it was a hot day to be wearing oh, a tell me full about suit. It. <laughs> <laughs> so, as you saw, there are three tasks, there are three items on the table. Yeah. It's up to them how they did it. So, we'll have a look at Bob and Ashling first. Uh oh. Standing behind this rope, throw one item into the bucket. You may retrieve the item if it misses. But you must be stood behind the rope on every throw. You may not move the rope or the bucket. Fastest wins. Your time started when you opened the first task and ends when you completed all three tasks. So I'm going to go for the wheat picks. Thank okay. you very much. I'm trying not to show how incredibly pleased. <laughs> I am that. Eat one item, fastest wins. Eat one item. Fastest time wins. Come on, rope. The one item is the one. Oh, rope. Oh. I really could have eaten the trigger.
Balance one item. Ah! Oh! On top of the red pole. The item must stay balanced until the entire task is completed. You may not take the pole out of the ground. The fastest wins. I mean, you said balance, so they are... Thank you, Bob. I've stopped the clock. Interesting. Thank you, Alex. That's the saddest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> The office. I would love to know how long it took between the words eat one item and <laughs> you getting that in your mouth. <laughs> I would argue it was less than tenth of a second. I yeah. think you heard yeah, eat yeah. and you ate. Yeah, yeah. And if I'd lived, if I'd gone like this with the paper, I would have seen a twiglet, but instead I just went, that! Oh, no, yeah. no, 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 no,
perhaps you'd like to join me down here and we'll work out how that's affected the final scores. <laughs> Well, now. Well, now. That will have put the cat amongst the pigeons, I shouldn't wonder. <laughs> <laughs> I was mainly uh, on David Watch, who was getting very close to the edge of the stage. Yeah. I was prepared to die for Taskmaster. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't work. You came last. <laughs> <laughs> so David got 12% of his balls in the right place. Hello. Rose put all of hers in the bucket, which meant a third of hers were in the right place. The rest were all wrong, but 33% right. Katie and Ed both got 45% right. <laughs> Oh. And get four points each for that reason. But Joe was a runaway winner and pretty much nailed it. Pretty much got every single thing right except for the ones wow. she threw at the audience. I'm happy now. For more Taskmaster, subscribe now. <laughs> <laughs>